Is that a Motorola Moto X? Yep. A 2014 edition? Yep. And is that wireless charging? The 2014 edition Motorola Moto X is an amazing phone. It features top-end specs and untouched design and the ability to customize it to your liking, but it definitely has its flaws and that includes a subpar camera. It's not the best in my personal opinion. It doesn't have the best display. It has a very small battery, so it's not gonna give you the best battery life and it also doesn't have wireless charging. Well, this trick is gonna work for the Galaxy Note 4, the OnePlus One, and the 2014 edition Motorola Moto X. In fact, this will work for any phone that has a micro USB charging port. So let's get started. The very first thing you're going to need is a case for your device. In this case, I have a Dishtronic case for the 2014 edition Motorola Moto X. So that's what I'll be demonstrating this trick with. And you're also going to need a wireless charging receiver. In this case, I picked up one from Blue Boom. It had very high ratings on Amazon and it was only about $12. The case itself only set me back by about nine bucks. So this entire thing is going to be less than $25. It'll be about $20. 2627 with shipping. Inside the Blue Boon packaging, all you're going to get is the universal wireless charging receiver, which happens to plug into a micro USB port. However, this is the one with the arrow side up. If you wanted to get it for the OnePlus One, you're going to need one with the arrow side down. So go ahead and get your Motorola Moto X or whatever device that you have and plug in the universal wireless charging receiver. This is gonna plug right into the micro USB port at the bottom or top of your phone or side of your phone, wherever it is located. Once you have it plugged in, just fold it to the back of your device so it's kinda of like resting against the back plate. Then you're gonna to wanna to take whatever case you have or whatever device you have and put it on. It's a very easy process. However, it might be a little bit of a tight fit due to the fact that you have to fit the case over the little lump at the bottom, which I'll show you in just a minute. And just make sure everything is secure and fast and here's a quick look at the bottom and you can see it is a chrome little plug that plugs into the micro USB port and you can see the wires actually tucked behind the case so you really can't tell it almost looks like the little flap that covered the Galaxy S5 so as I'm demonstrating how fast this thing can actually charge your phone I'm gonna give you a rundown of the wireless charging receiver itself it has a charging distance of 5 millimeters it has an input of 1000 milliamps and a charging current of 500 to 1000 milliamps and a working life of 4000 times in other words you should be able to get 4,000 charges out of this thing before it just dies. Unfortunately, I have not had it long enough to test it out 4,000 times, so let's just hope for the best. Now, the Galaxy Note 4 is also fully compatible with this universal wireless charging receiver, and to put it on, you're going to want to take off the back plate and go ahead and pop it into the micro USB port at the bottom. If you use a case on your Note 4, you don't even have to take off the battery cover. I'm just showing you a better way to conceal the wireless charging receiver. Once you have it plugged in and flipped over to the back, make sure it's not covering the rear firing speed speaker and then take the battery cover or the back plate and pop it into place. Make sure everything is secure and snapped into place just like it would if you didn't have the wireless charging receiver on there. The bottom part of the battery cover is not going to fully lock in or snap in but you're not going to notice it. It's not going to be any less secure than not having the wireless charger installed. Just from day-to-day -day use I have not had the battery cover accidentally pop off or anything like that. And here's a quick example of how it is fully compatible with the Samsung Galaxy Note 4. However the charging time is going to be much longer than the Moto X due to the fact that this is a larger battery. Wireless charging is awesome. However, there's going to be times where you just need a fast charge. And in that case, all you have to do is unplug the wireless charging receiver from the bottom or your micro USB port, and then plug in your rapid charger, your turbo charger, or your traditional wall charger. And it works just as if there was no wireless charging receiver in there. And then when you're done, all you got to do is just pop it back in and you're ready to go for wireless charging again. Now, as I said in the beginning, this is fully compatible with the OnePlus One. However, I just got the wrong charging adapter. You need to get the one that has the arrow side down. This is the one with the arrow side up and you can see the cable itself folds back over the micro USB port and you don't want it to do that. Now, I tried and tried to get the back cover taken off so that way I can try to conceal this wireless charging receiver and I just couldn't do it. But in any case, this one does still work even though it is the wrong adapter. You can see 
see it still does come on and you can see at the top there it does have the little spinning wheel that the Cyanogen Mod uh, 11S comes with so you can see that it is charging plus the green LED light is lit to indicate that the phone is charging. And just like the Samsung Galaxy Note 4 this is going to take longer to charge than the 2014 or 13 Motorola Moto X due to the fact that this does have a larger battery. Well guys that does it for me. I really hope that you're enjoying wireless charging on your device now if it didn't already come with wireless charging. If you like this video and you want to see more like it make sure you drop me a thumbs up and let me know in the comment section what device that you're using this on and also if you want to see more videos what videos you would like to see in the future as it's always great to hear back from you guys the link to the products mentioned in this video can be found in the description below and if you feel like being awesome shop at the amazon link below because it does help out the channel hit me up on my social media connections and subscribe so you don't miss nothing and i'll catch you guys in the next one